Hey everybody, this is Jonathan Perez from Surefire Web Services and recently I've been getting a few questions about what happens when you disable the Beaver Builder plugin. Now I'm on my staging site and right now you can see it's kind of a mess because I'm constantly in development. But if I click over to the Genesis maintenance plans, you'll see this page which is completely built with the Beaver Builder plugin. So what happens when I deactivate it? Let's find out. I'm going to head over to my plugins installed plugins look for beaver and I'm going to deactivate it so it's gone let's go back to the maintenance page and as you can see it basically just took all of the content that was in the page or in the sections and just kinda of spit it out I keep scrolling down no format or anything just straight text if I click edit page you'll see everything pretty much in the WYSIWYG editor and that's what happens when you deactivate the Beaver Builder plugin. Now, if I want to go back and reactivate it, let's see what happens then. Click on my installed plugins, find Beaver. I'm going to activate it, go back into the website, click on Genesis Maintenance, and the formatting has stood the same. So, Beaver Builder. Great plugin. I highly recommend it to anybody looking to make awesome web pages quickly, painlessly, and just freaking plain awesomely. <laughs> That's it. See you next time.